Today, we're going to take a closer look at one of the most iconic birds of the American Southwest, the Greater Roadrunner. This bird is known for its lightning-fast speed, but there's so much more to discover. From its unique adaptations for desert life to its fascinating hunting skills, the Roadrunner is full of surprises. So let's get started and explore five amazing facts about the Greater Roadrunner. Fact 1. Roadrunners love to run. The Greater Roadrunner can reach running speeds of at least 20 miles per hour. That's faster than most people can sprint. Don't be fooled by the Saturday morning cartoons, though. Coyotes can run twice as fast as Roadrunners. They can and do prey upon Roadrunners. To get away from coyotes and other terrestrial predators, Roadrunners run zigzag through the brush, hop up into trees, and may even fly. The flight of roadrunners is slow and labored on short, rounded wings. They can reach flight speeds of up to 17 miles per hour, but they only fly actively for short distances. They may glide down slope after a burst of flapping. Roadrunners always prefer to run rather than to fly. Fact 2. Greater roadrunners are omnivores. They eat both plants and animals. Their diet is varied. It includes insects, spiders, scorpions, lizards, snakes, rodents, birds, eggs, fruit, and seeds. Roadrunners are excellent hunters. In one study in Texas, these birds ate large quantities of reptiles, especially horned lizards. I've seen roadrunners visit outdoor patios at restaurants and eat hamburger and other meat scraps tossed by the patrons. Roadrunners will even kill and eat rattlesnakes. A pair of roadrunners will work together to kill the snake. One bird usually distracts the snake by jumping up near it. The other roadrunner strikes from behind. It pecks through the head or slams the snake's head against a rock. Fact 3. Greater roadrunners are a member of the cuckoo family. Roadrunners are in the ground cuckoo subfamily. They share the cuckoo's toe arrangement. Two toes point forward and two point backward in an X pattern. This unique foot structure gives roadrunners a better grip on the ground and helps them maneuver around obstacles. And it also creates a very unique track in the sand. Unlike many cuckoos, roadrunners don't lay their eggs in other birds' nests. Instead, they build their own nest in a tree, cactus, or brush. These nests are shaded and 3 to 10 feet off the ground. They build their nest with twigs, leaves, feathers, and even snakeskin. They lay three to five eggs. Both parents take part in all aspects of nest building, incubation, and caring for the young. In fact, the male does most of the incubation at night. Young roadrunners run and chase down their own food after they have been out of the nest only three weeks. Fact number four. Greater roadrunners are equipped to survive in the hot and dry climate of the desert. Roadrunners can lower their body temperature at night to conserve energy. Then in the morning you may see them warming up in the sun. They face their back to the sun and fluff their feathers. The sun warms the black skin on their backs. These birds rest in the shade during the hottest part of the day so they don't overheat. They are most active in morning and evening. Roadrunners have special glands near their eyes that help them get rid of excess salt from their body through the nostrils. Roadrunners rarely drink water. They get most of their water from the foods they eat. Birds don't sweat. They have poor kidney function compared to mammals. They have to get rid of excess salt another way. When they need to cool off quickly, roadrunners pant, fluttering their unfeathered guller area below the chin. Fact number five, greater roadrunners have unique vocalizations that sound like a series of coos, whirs, and clicks. The courtship or territorial song is a slow, descending series of three to eight low coos given by the male. This song is often given before sunrise and carries up to one quarter of a mile. These birds sometimes snap their bills rapidly, making a clicking rattle sound. This may be to signal other birds that a predator is near. Roadrunners also communicate with the distinctive crest on their head. They raise or lower their crest expressively depending on their mood. When they are excited or aggressive, they raise their crest. 
Do you have any interesting stories about Roadrunners? Tell me in the comments. Check out my playlists for more videos on individual birds as well as birdwatching tips and identification. Thank you so much for watching.